Yeah, it's time to it. show you this one. It's headlines from around the globe. Britain's Guardian says following Pope Francis on Twitter can get you time off from purgatory. The Pope goes to Brazil next week for Catholic World Youth Day. The Vatican is encouraging the faithful to keep track of the Pope's visit on television, radio, and social media. Your sins will be pardoned. Why are you laughing? Your sins will be pardoned, but only if you follow the events live. Wow. Forbes, Forbes magazine, Sarah Blakely has something to share a little bit later on, I see. Forbes magazine looks at Hollywood's highest paid actors. Robert Downey Jr. tops the list. He earned $75 million from June 2012 to June 2013. Thanks to hit movies like The Avengers and Iron Man 3, the second highest paid is Channing Tatum, who's a new dad, followed by... Hugh Jackman. And the Los Angeles Times says McDonald's has launched a website offering financial advice to its employees. The website seems to suggest that workers will need a second job to get by. Fast food chains are often criticized for paying only minimum wage. There's a lot more to that story. You should check it out. Indeed. USA Today says all-star baseball players may benefit from having facial hair. The last six all-star MVPs each had whiskers. <laughs> You're a great audience. That changed last night when the Yankees' Mariano Rivera was named most valuable player. He is clean shaven.